We're now joined by Dia Mirza, actor, producer, UN Environment Goodwill Ambassador, and UN, UN, UN Advocate for Sustainable Development Goals. Uh, thank you, Dia, for joining us. And you're an active supporter of social campaigns. You've supported many of our campaigns here at NDTV. You've spoken for children's rights in the past. So tell us how you got interested in this issue of child marriage and how you decided to jo join this campaign as well. Uh, I've always been an uh, admirer of Kailashji and the incredible work that he is doing to stop child marriage in India. It's uh, truly unfortunate that we continue to, you know, witness the prevalence of child marriage. It is um, deeply divisive. It's uh, driving inequalities. It's just an awful reality that has to be changed. And I think as a person in the public sphere, I have the you know good fortune to be a part of movements, campaigns, and support governments and organizations that are doing good work to completely eradicate child marriage in our country. Uh, I hope that um, my participation today will help make people better informed and aware of the prevalence uh, of child marriage and the fact that we need to stop this. Well, great to have you as a part of this campaign supporting it. And Dia, we believe you have a question for Kailashji. Kailashji Chaya's story is so inspiring. <laughs> Chaya is an example of a young girl who stood up for herself, who fought for herself and did it with such grace. Um, I'm wondering how can we make this uh, you know, a possibility for more young girls. Of course, awareness is important. She discovered that she could stand up for her rights. How do we make more girls understand that they can stand up for themselves? There are organizations like your foundation that are willing to help, that there are government bodies and helpline numbers that young girls can call and seek help from. Can it be mandated to schools? Uh, can younger girls be taught about this? What, what is the solution? Thank you, Diaji. Uh, thanks for your uh, support. Chaya is one of those hundreds of examples from our child friendly villages, Bal Mitra Mandals, and uh, other activities across India, where these girls are so empowered then they speak out for themselves and they have shown the leadership and championship for the protection of all child rights and well-being of children in their own sphere. Hamari koshis hai and I strongly believe that no voice can be more compelling, stronger and genuine voice than the voice of young people like Chaya. And that's why we have to create an environment. In fact, the entire ecosystem where the children could speak out for themselves and for others. And this is slowly happening. Not only in India, but across the world, these young people like Chaya cannot wait for others that suddenly somebody will come from the heaven and change their fate. This is not going to happen. So they are taking the rein in their hands and that is very, very good sign for our country and for the rest of the world. So they can do it. You're right that such kind of things should be taught in, in the schools. We across about 700 and more villages have been able to achieve it where the youth, children of the village were able to find some way out. They have created a children's parliament or Bal Panchayat and Bal Panchayats are determined that no child labor, no child marriage, no child sexual abuse, no child trafficking and all girls and boys irrespective of their caste and community must be attending a school and retain in schools and good quality education is provided for them. So, this is all people are doing in the country and they need to increase it more. I think that we need to encourage our nations, our religious gurus, our government officers and our पंचायतों को सबको ये प्रमोट करना चाहिए कि बच्चे खुद अपनी आवाज बने ताकि इन बुराइयों का खात्मा किया जा सके उनको सपोर्ट करना चाहिए दोज हु फील दैट द यंग पीपल आर द प्रॉब्लम्स दे आर एब्सोल्युटली रॉन्ग यंग पीपल आर द सॉल्यूशंस ऑफ एनी प्रॉब्लम प्रिवेल एनीवेयर इन द वर्ल्ड एंड दे शुड बी एनकरेज 
to be the problem solvers, champions and the leaders.